Dude. What, uh, did you ever get to meet Marilyn Manson? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah. That was my first concert. He's a fucking, he's a, he's a fucking great guy. Yeah, I re hear really interesting things about him. Kat Von D is close with him, and she speaks a lot about him. Yeah. You know, or she mentions him a lot, you know. Yeah, he's, um, he's, a, he's a fucking, he's funny, man. Was there, um, oh, that's you and him. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's cool. He has a good sense of humor. Oh, yeah, dude. He's, he's fucking, he's definitely a, he's a fucking tweaker. Yeah. 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 He's actually. BYO blinds, huh? Yeah. 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 He's yeah, fucking dude. wild. Oh. He, he turned me on to some fucking, man, this crazy, we, we drank a fucking shitload of this absinthe uh, in Europe. That was his thing's absinthe and like showed me like. And I don't know. It just I, I'd seen this shit called Green Fairy or whatever. It's mm -hmm. green, but he had some other, some like other. I, I started hallucinating on the shit. Yeah. If you drink enough of it, you start to slightly hallucinate, and it was purple colored, and um, and it's an alcohol as well. Yeah, yeah. It's it's full on alcohol, mm. strong as fuck. Mm. Um, yeah. And you drink the shit on fire, like you light the sugar cubes and yeah. the sugar melts into the absinthe. Oh, shit. It's a whole, like, a ritual thing. Yeah, yeah. ritualistic. It's, I like that. Yeah, it's dark. I could see him getting into some ritualistic shit. It, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. He yeah. <laughs> yeah. Does absinthe really make you hallucinate? Absinthe, a liqueur, is a combination of spirits and herbs, mainly fennel, and anise, and a type of wormwood called Artemisia absinthium. Um, yeah. that's what it's named after Van Gogh and Picasso were big fans of absinthe back in the day, along with other artists. Some believe that absinthe induced hallucinations partly inspired some of their greatest works. Wow. Right. 